Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another video. Today I'm going to be showing how to troubleshoot Windows Store application issues within the Windows 10 operating system. So if you're having any issues with applications in the Windows Store, like they're crashing and they're acting very slowly, this troubleshooting program will hopefully help remedy these issues. So first, it's important to mention that you have to be logged into an administrative or administrator account in order to do what we're about to do. So with that out of the way, we're going to start by heading over to our search menu. And we're going to type in troubleshooting. should be listed directly above the control panel so you want to left click on that and then on the left side here you want to select view all near the bottom of this list we see there's an option that says Windows Store Apps you want to right click on it and then left click on run as administrator Okay, so this new window says we can troubleshoot and help prevent computer problems. So left click on this little advanced button right here and make sure it's checkmarked where it says apply repairs automatically. So just a little bit of information here. It says a Windows Store apps troubleshoot problems that may prevent Windows Store apps from working properly. And then select next at the bottom of this window. So the troubleshooting tool will begin scanning. It honestly should not take that long, but just give it a few minutes. So we already see that there's one action that you know, there shows there's a confliction. You definitely need to have a Microsoft account to sync your settings. Um, if I skip to next here, we see that the problem found was that a Microsoft account needs to be linked. If you have any other issues with the store, they'll be labeled here. And since we had a check mark to automatically fix and resolve those issues, if we did have any other issues that were non creating a Microsoft account related, hopefully they would be resolved. So I hope this tutorial helped you guys out, and I will see you in the next video. Goodbye.